Connection don't blow. It don't blow. Yes. How? I don't understand. Oga okay, looking at this matter electrically. You be like say person don't go that place, go touch and the things spark. I make the things spoil. Oh. What are you saying? We stay alone in this compound, so who must have tampered with it? Madam, now waiting. I no know be that Please call the electrician so he can come visit first thing in the morning. Okay, Oga. Okay. I don't get a recharge card for phone like this. Go, oh, cool. I will send you a time. Uh -huh. Madam, please, if you want to send, send more because I'm owing empty and want 2000 Please go. Cool. Can you get out? Okay, sir. Oh. Um, by the way, where are the kids? I haven't seen them since I came in. What happened to your face? It was them. I told them that electricity is the most dangerous thing in the world. But they said I should destroy the electricity with, with a screwdriver. Come here, come back. What are you saying? Are you telling me that you and your siblings are responsible for the spoilage of the light connection? No, no, no. no. The police it's was there. Yeah, we what her. exactly is wrong with you people? Who, who are you possessed or what? So me. You know you feel like By the time I am done with the three of you, you will tremble whenever you see valuable in this house. Now go upstairs to my room. Lay down on the cold ties and wait for me. Now! Oh, 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 I hope you're enjoying the food. Yes, so Grandpa. I don't know the last time I tested the kind of food. Really? Mm. So, you're trying to tell me that I don't know how to cook? 
Okuya? In our body, one of But jokes apart, Papa, you're one of the best chefs in the world. Mm. Jesus, he is a sinner. Chai. My daughter, Papa. I'm so happy to have you around. Mm? I've missed you. I missed you too. Why are you looking this sad? What's the cause of your sadness? Papa, nothing. I'm fine. See, I can see through your eyes, to your heart. I know that you are going through unimaginable pains. Talk to your father. You are home now. You don't have any reason to fear. I won't let anything happen to you while I am still alive. Papa. I just wish I can start any business of my own in this village. Palm wine and um, dog meat business? You still remember it? Papa, you book on a guy. Papa. You know, when you were growing up, you had special interest for this line of business. But you know what I'm going to do for you? I'm going to introduce you to someone who does this business. He will show you where you can get fresh and unadulterated palm wine. And we also tell you which of the markets that you will get dog meat. And you'll be ready to go. Papa, thank you so much. <laughs> I wonder you. what I would have done without a father like you. Mm. Thank you. Grandpa, yeah. thank you. Thank you, my angel. Thank you so much, Papa. Mm. Uh -huh. It too, because you mm -hmm. need all the power you can get now. Mm -hmm. Once I start my business, I and then yellow mark. My son B T. But thank you. Thank you, my dear. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Good afternoon, Daddy. Good afternoon. Let's go home. So, how was school today? Sit belt. Are you okay? If you don't look happy, what is it, my baby?
my love, I have observed that you've been unhappy since Olana and her son left this house. You see, I don't know why I went so hard on her. Something in me tells me I shouldn't have sent her out of the house. My prince, you don't have to beat up yourself. Hmm? You are a good man. She should be happy that you didn't order for her hair to be shot off, considering the level of atrocity that she committed in this house. Hmm? You see, I've been asking myself, why would she go to such extent of disrespecting me? Oh. <laughs> why would she bring a man into my own house, slept with that same man on my own bed? I mean, that was the height of it. Exactly, my love. Exactly. That is what she does. She used to bring in different men to sleep with them in this house. I warned her though, but she continued. Thank God you are here to witness this one, so you look as if I'm cooking up stories. Eh? Baby, you should be happy that they are out of this house and out of our lives for good. So we don't have to corrupt our unborn children. Please, just snap out of the mood right there. Hmm? You know what? I made your favorites. Trust me, this time you will like it. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. I'm not. I'm not famished. I'm not hungry. Come on, baby. I'm serious. You will like it. <laughs> Let's go in. <laughs> What's with the long faces? What's with the long faces? My thoughts, exactly. They haven't said a word to each other since I went to pick them. Really? Honey? This is the best time for the conversation. Um, while we are all seated already, let's rub minds together. You know, me and your mother here are not ignorant of the fact that all this nuisance you guys have been creating lately in this house it's because you want to punish us and make us change our mind towards allowing you to go to government school. Exactly, Dad. Yes. yes. That's what we want. I haven't asked you to talk. There are a lot of dangers associated with going to a government school. Let me tell you a little story. My father could barely pay my school fees. I had to hawk such hot water so that I can pay my school fees. I went to a government school, but it was filled with mischievous touts who lacked proper home training. They bullied other students, they jumped fence, they even bullied their teachers. I cannot even begin to tell you guys a lot of unimaginable things happening there. So I vowed that my children will not suffer what I suffered. Sweetheart. Mommy. Your father and I love you so much. We care about you. We want your well-being. We want the best for you. And that is why we are toiling day in, day out to give you the best life. That is why you are schooling in the most prestigious private school that is well known for their moral behaviors. I want you to wisen up. 
Don't be like the foolish man whose sugar was put in his mouth, but he spat it out, saying it is bitter. Does sugar taste bitter? No. So please, wisen up. Be wise. We are your parents. We cannot deceive you. You see those children that you are envious of? The ones in government school. Those children will do anything and everything possible to be in your shoes. Mommy, it's our shoes. And we are the one wearing them. We know how it hurts. In fact, this shoe you bought for me, it's not my size of shoe. Shut up, Mugu. Every time they, Shut they up. talk, you, you be saying I'm your different senior. things. Mm. My uncle is that you. You don't have sense. Anytime you do something wrong, you'll be the shut first up. person to say, shut you up. You shut up. Yes. You don't have sense. Shut, shut up. You're not shut up. up. Shut, shut up. up. I forbid you from speaking in such manner about your elder sister. She's not my elder sister. Shut up. Mommy, she's right. I forbid you. Have you lost your manners? How dare you speak when I'm speaking? Are you okay? Any more word to oppose my stand on this issue? I will make sure you guys regret the day you came up with that insane idea of attending that government school. Now we all go to your room and go freshen up and look for what to eat. for me yes my prince I did you know I was not just the prime minister to the throne but also a very good friend and confiner to your father your late father the king why did I say that your father told me how dear to his heart the development of this great kingdom on the accord was to him and how to liberate them from poverty and my prince if you did not accomplish all this your father will not be happy even in the grave so we need to do something very fast my prince um. Uncle, I appreciate your coming. And I, I must say, I appreciate your area of concern. But I would appreciate this more if you can go further to portray your points. I mean, what exactly are you trying to say? My Prince, what I'm saying is that uh, the white men will be coming in in the next seven market days to seal up the deal that we have with them. And not just to seal it, but to start up the good mile factory building in this our community and if you remember our neighboring village has gold in their land and they are doing everything possible to convince the white men to build that factory in their own community instead and the uh, I will appreciate if we can act very fast so that this opportunity will not miss this very opportunity, my prince. Be good. Uncle, what do we do? My prince, what you should do. Uh, I think uh, the best option now is for you to bring a woman you intend to marry to enable you ascend to the throne. Yes, not just only for the throne, but for your late parents and also for the people of Undiako. Biko, this our throne cannot just be empty. Biko.
Let's say you are looking for me. Yes, um, I want to talk to you about something. My name is Olanda. I'm Mr. Hygieno's daughter. I just came back to the village and I told my father I would love to start double to my wine business. So my father knows I'm very passionate about that specific business. So he told me that you've been on it for a very long time and you're successful. He said I should come to you so you can impart some knowledge. At least tell me where to get on at the wine and affordable documents. Is that why you are here? Yes, sir. I'm here so you can guide me. I'm here so you can direct me. I'm here so you can help me. I really want to go into this business. I want to be successful like you. I want to start making money for myself. And don't ever come to this shop, this bar, to say this nonsense. I am the only pan wine and dog meat seller in this place. Go and ask questions. About people that try to compete with me in this business. In this business. I mean people that try to compete with me in this business for how they all end up. Oh nonsense. Oh nonsense. What is that? Oh nonsense. Oh nonsense. Has the future queen of India to be doing the wine of the week? My love, nothing much. Honestly, I'd be so bored without you around. Mm. You know, <laughs> life without you it's like an embodiment that only your love can feel. Uh huh. <laughs> I can't stop being grateful to the king above all skies for granting me a rare angel like you to be with. You're always naughty. <laughs> mm. I'm curious. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Marry me and make me the happiest man of us. Yes. Yes. Yes, I'll marry you. I'll marry you, my friend. <laughs> I will spend the entire world to make you happy. This must have cost you a fortune. More to come. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Jay. Mm. My angel. <laughs> Ah! Tell me. Hey, Papa. My angel, you're back. How did it go? It did not go well. Tell me. Papa, he's such a mean person. He told me that no one dares do the same business with him in this village. Mm -hmm. As a matter of fact, he said I should go and verify. I should go and ask everyone that has ever tried to do the same business with him. That's if there is anyone alive. That's what he told me. <laughs> My daughter, it is just an empty threat. The guy is afraid that if you do the same business with him, you will take all his customers. Forget about him. So what do I do? Yes. Oh! Old age. I've forgotten that I have a palm tree on my farmland. The best palm tree in this community. You know what you need to do? You need to hire someone who will climb the tree and tap the palm wine fresh for you. Papa, I equally forgot. What do I need anyone for? I am the man you never had. I can do it all. <laughs> Through Christ that strengthens me. I will tap the wine myself, Papa. My daughter, you have to be very careful. Papa, I can tap the wine. 
See, let me tell you, I love you so much. And even men who tap my wine, they still have blood in their veins when they fall. Hmm? So I will not fall. <laughs> Where is my son, Papa? He has finished eating, he's resting peacefully, and your food is on the dining table. Papa, thank you so much. I am privileged to have you as my father. I pray that one day I'll be able to repay you for this kindness, this love, this support you've been showing me. Eh? I love you, Papa. Thank you. I love you too. You still remain that my little girl. That my little angel that I would do anything for. Hmm? Thank you, Papa. And as for the dog meat, you can get it in any of the slaughters in the marketplace. You can buy any size. Hmm? But right now, I want you to get to the dining table so that I can eat. I will. What are you? Maybe my girl was talking. Is that you? Is that you? Okay, so. Please now. Oh, oh, oh. Hello, yo. Anna, yo. Come on, see it. Anna, yo. Anna, yo. So it has got to the point when you see me, you cover your face. So that I will not recognize you. But when you were eating Pomo 2120 on credit, you did not cover your face. On credit, though. On credit. Do not embarrass me because of 2,120 naira. Am I the only person owing? Even the king is owing the, ne the neighboring village, let alone me. So do not embarrass me, Jidenna. Wait, 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 wait. Eh? Am I hearing you? So this one can come out that you're using eating 2,120 naira meat. I am using it to talk rubbish. You don't have sense, so I'm happy. Will you shut your trap before I slap this respect out of your memory? Look at this little rat. Look at, look at. Don't you not have your mate at home? So don't insult me. Ka! If you're the one my mate, how dare you buy something for me without paying? Eh? Mm. Huh? Even the Bible said it. Somebody that owes somebody is the slave to that person. So we are your masters. And I command you to pay me my money now. Jidenna, so you are here. This your little rat is insulting me. Jidenna, you are here. This your little rat is insulting me. Hey, Jidenna, look, let me tell you something. I can't stand here and watch both of you, you and your little rat, insult me, insult me in this manner. I can't take it from you, Jidenna. Hey. Jidenna, I've warned you. I can't take it from you. And who told you you're standing? Huh? You are not on the ground! Huh? Are you sure? Huh? Hey. 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 Naira. It is even more than the worth of the entire pomo that we wanted to sell today. I'm telling you. In fact, you see what I have? I will just go in, bath, and sleep. Today is work free day for me. <laughs> what of my share now? This I am putting your money in your pocket. What of my own share now? Share of what? No share of our money. Uh, why, why, why should I give you share of my own money? Why won't you give me? Eh? 
Eh? Isn't that me that that notice it was Anna? Baba, you it's not for me. You couldn't have recognized me. That is number one. No. Number two, I was the one that collected the pep, the, 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 all the money from his pocket. Number three, I rubbed paper in his eye. Unfortunately. Number four, assuming I do not rub that paper, that man could have chased us and collected his money. Because you and I know that you are not strong. Uh, you could have collected his money. Okay. Nefechi, that one is your business. I will not give you fatten couple from this money. No sense. You want to share my money with me? Look at you. Come on, you will not get from me. But I'm not good. Come on, give me my shell. Try. This one, we kid. Try. Since man died, since man burial. So, I don't have no color with this one. Now. This man for don't guy guy me like this. But come and share my own. Come and share my... Come and give me my shell. Like this one, you know? As we all know, we are gathered here today for the coronation of our prince and his marriage to our future queen of this our great kingdom, Ndiako Kingdom. So may we begin. Woman. Are you on your flower? I mean, your monthly flow. Um, um, is a more, um, yes. Ah, I will. Hey. Hey, That means both the coronation and the traditional marriage cannot take place oh. today. As a more. Mm -hmm. It's a call of nature. Yes. And as such, we should proceed with what we're doing. Exactly. Or if an announce also. The Zemo has spoken. Eh? The eyes of the gods have spoken. Uh, but um hmm? but Guinea. But Guinea. Everybody, you know. Omeka but Guinea. That is, eh? Do something. Oh, please. Did you? Did you? Did you? Even when I guess, I mean, I guess. Hey. Is, but what I'm trying to say. Whatever the problem is here, we have already invited the world to come and celebrate with us. Exactly. Yes. Exactly. I will find a way for now. We are. Exactly. You can move it and do it. Say more, please. Do something. Tradition uh -huh. does not know whether you spend money or not. That's right. There's a more. Ezemo. Ah, excuse me, Ezemo. Do Ezemo. something, do something. Ezemo. What about our people who are waiting outside? Ezemo, mm -hmm. the ocean is deep and dark, and yet it has its limits. Ezemo, if you look around this place, you will see that people are still trooping in. Vehicles are still driving in. People came from far and near to embrace this day. Ezemo, how do you? Explain to these people that such an occasion is being cancelled because of many natural flow. I said, more please, I am begging you on my honor as the prince of this kingdom. Please, can we find a way to resolve this with the gods? Please. said no. Ah! Mm. This occasion will take place the next market day. Kill us. Thank you. 